Quiet please! And... One day, for heartbreaking reasons, became a small parcel for the poor and almost dying soul of Olaf Kaus. It was a book by Seyul Breifer called Numari. Okay, take two, quiet please, and action. One day, for heartbreaking reasons, became a small parcel for the poor and almost dead soul of all of the country. It was a book by Seul de Breifer called Numari. Acquaintance with Seul de Breifer's poetry brought a new dawn of experience brighter than any had been before. <laughs> It was a book by Seyur Breifjörn called Numari. Acquaintance with Seyur Breifjörn's poetry brought a new dawn of experience brighter than any had been before. He discovered in a flash that there were differences between poets. Alright, are we ready? And quiet place! And action. One day, for heartbreaking reasons, there came a small parcel for the poor and almost dead soul of Olaf Kaus. It was a book by Seyru Breifjörn called Numari. Acquaintance with Seyru Breifjörn's poetry brought a new dawn of experience brighter than any other thing before. He discovered in a flash that there was a difference between poets. Seyur the Breitner found his way to every heart with sorrow and beauty. Towards the end of winter, poor Olaf knew all of his poems by heart. And Seyur the Breitner reigned supreme over his soul. And so it happened on the first sunny days of February that the poet himself stepped down from a sunbeam on the ceiling and put his hand on all of his powers of Yosemite. Now he discovered in a flash that there was difference between poets. <laughs> 